I'm here at the Geekery with uh, new comic artist Jason Liu. Hey, what's going on, Dr. Siebel? So you are the creator and writer of the Pitiful Human Lizards. That is right. You've done your research. I have. And you're on issue number... Five. five. Yeah. So five, so five issues, and how are we doing? How are the fans taking this? Uh, fantastic. Uh, fantastic. Is that a pun you just finished? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, well, now that you brought that up, yeah, sure, we, we can use that. Uh, <laughs> uh, now that my series has been picked up by Chapman House Comics and it was, it's was it been going through uh, Diamond Distribution, uh, so like all these fans, or, or new fans from, from the States, uh, or like even like all around the world like have like, like reached out worldwide. to me. It's worldwide. Yeah, really? exactly. I it was just Toronto, so every... No, no, Where's no. Where's the furthest place that they've um, contacted you from? Uh, Australia. Australia. They yeah. said they like the pitiful human lizards. Yes. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah. Congratulations. And and like recently, like there was this comic book store like in, in Baltimore, Maryland that was like, yeah, like a, like a, 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 I came to Toronto, picked up issue numbers one to three, and, and it's great to see it in, in Diamond so I can order it for my comic book store, and I would like to invite you whenever you're in the area. It's like, that's amazing. Yeah, if I'm ever there like that's it's great to feel welcome there awesome yeah so have you been invited for any other like um comic cons around canada uh not at the moment like my 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 my, my show schedule is kind of free open at the moment but uh you know i do have some big plans going on for next year Excellent. Yeah. Now with Chapter House, this is the same company that's doing Captain Canuck. That's correct, the one and only. Are, are there going to be any team-ups with the Human Lizard and Captain Canuck? That's what we're looking for. Eventually, yeah. Just like you know, just like the Marvel universe, just like the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Like you, you want to establish all the characters first. That when all. Or how about Arrow and um, Flash? That, that's the latest really cool thing. Yeah, I guess. Well, like Flash was more of a product from Arrow. Like. When we're talking about the TV series. No, but I'm talking like two different things. Zero was way too serious. Flash was like totally lighthearted. Captain Canuck is like, you know, kick-ass superhero. And yours is like a struggling guy. So, I mean, I can see how, a, like, that would be a cool cop show. A similar dynamics. Movie. Yeah, similar dynamics. And, and you know, like, when you see these, when you follow each title individually, like, it, uh... You know, like they, they, they have like their own merits of, of why they're so good, and then when, when you see them connect, uh, it's gonna be as powerful as like an Avengers movie, Ooh. just so like that. Is this speculation or something that may be happening? In a... uh, I'm not free to talk about that yet, but but you know everybody wants to see it. Yes, yes. Uh, in, in August, I had a, a mini comic, a mini, uh, comic. a mini comic, where. Uh, you, you got to see the, the first time where the human lizard got to meet or, or crossed over with Captain Canuck. It was not really a team up, it was not like them meeting and shaking hands, but you actually see them in the same area and Great. see where they stand in the same world. Of course. So there's a possibility that would be quite cool. Yeah, exactly. Excellent. Um, now, at the, yeah, your last signing, I met your parents who I happened to see in the comic first, so I was like, kind of starstruck on oh my gosh oh my gosh she's in like a <laughs> beautiful human lizard uh, I love my parents and uh, you know this is like my way to pay homage to them well how do, how do they feel about this um, I think they're happy now like seeing you know I'd show them like some of the press that I've been getting with the comics and tell them stuff like yeah my comics being taught in University of Toronto I'm doing lectures and stuff like that and and you know my, my, my mom would pick up the comic and read and like yeah she's enjoying it which is great like she, she's now seeing my comic not as a hobby but as a potential career that I uh, it, she, she was born in Canada was she uh, no no see that this is where I have a but my, my, my parents met in, in Toronto though no that's cool because yeah. what I'm trying to get is my my mother's from the old country yeah. so when I used to draw it's like Steve why are you drawing this stuff you go get real job <laughs> go for one and you know so I never really had the opportunity to pursue it I never got any support it's like why you waste your time on this drawing this monkey stuff like, oh, man. It's like no 
Yeah. 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 You go over get forward with your brother. This is good. Like, you know. so, yeah. So, so you know, like whenever like they would ask me when I was a kid, like, what would you like to be when you grow up? It's like, I want to draw comics. Like, yeah, as a hobby, right? As a hobby. It's like, no, no, as a living. <laughs> I can see your dad going, right. Yeah, he, he's more like, no, you're going to be a dentist or a doctor. But Great. that never yeah. worked out. Yeah. No. Oh, good for you. Well, I'm glad you're being successful. I'm glad Thank you're getting you. all these comics out. Thank you. Hopefully it turns into a 100% full-time career. I hope so, too. Uh, hopefully I can do not just Pitiful Human Lizard, but other projects as well. I look forward to this. Yeah. I think, I personally think he'd be great as an animated series. We'll hey. see. We'll see. Or maybe live action. Well, maybe I've said too much, but we'll see. Live action. Similar up there with the chick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great series, by the way. And it's coming back. Yes. Oh, great. All right. Thank you, Jason Liu, the creator of The Pitiful Human Lizards. Thank you, Steve. <laughs> <laughs>